All right, I am Christine Deschler, uh, Chair of the Arms and Finance Committee, and I'm calling the um, May 8th, 2023 meeting of the committee to order. First, I want to confirm attendance of members of the committee and make sure people can hear and be heard. So when I call out your name, could you please answer the in the affirmative? And if you are joining us via Zoom, could you indicate that as well? Uh, starting with Jordan. Here. Shane. Here, remote. Jennifer. Here. Sophie. Here, remote. Uh, Brian. Carolyn, Rebecca? Here. Josh? Here. Grant? Attending via Zoom. Charlie? Here. John? He is signing on right now. Here. All right. <laughs> Just made it under the wire. <laughs> yes. Daryl? Annie? L. Jones? Here. Sofer? Here. Peggy? Altosti? Here. Jean? Dave. Here, remote. And uh, Tara. Here. Our secretary. All right. So let me read the script. On March 29, 2023, Governor Healy signed into law a supplemental budget bill, which, among other things, extends the temporary provisions of the open meeting law to March 31st, 2025. This further extension allows public bodies to continue holding meetings remotely without a quorum of the body physically present at a meeting location so long as adequate alternative access to the deliberations of the meeting is provided to the public. Adequate alternative access includes providing public access through Zoom video conferencing, which we are doing tonight. Ensuring public access does not ensure public, public comment or public participation. This meeting will not feature public comment. Those wishing to provide comments may do so by emailing our executive secretary, Tara Bradley, at tbradley at town.arlington.ma.us. <clears throat> Please note that this meeting is being recorded and that some attendees are participating by video conference. Accordingly, be aware that other folks may be able to see you and take care not to screen share your computer. Anything that you broadcast may be captured by the recording. All supporting materials have been provided. Members of this body are available on the town's website unless otherwise noted. The public is encouraged to follow along using the posted agenda unless the chair notes otherwise. I will introduce each speaker and then recognize members wishing to provide any comment, questions, or motion. Please hold until your name is called. For those attending remotely, please remember to mute your phone or computer when you are not speaking. And everyone, please remember to speak clearly in a way that helps generate accurate minutes. We will take um, votes by way of roll call votes. Uh, first order of business is the minutes. Uh, I think we just have May 3rd to yep. approve, correct? Yes. Move we'll the exception. Second. Second. Any revisions, changes, errors, corrections? Anyone sees? All right. We'll take a vote to approve the minutes. Starting with Jordan. Yes. Shane. Yes. Jennifer. Yes. Sophie. Yes. Brian is not here. Carolyn is not here. Rebecca. Yes. Josh. Yes. Grant. Yes. Charlie. Yes. John. Yes. Daryl isn't here. Annie isn't here. Al Jones? Yes. Topher? Yes. Peggy is not here. Al Tosti? Yes. Dean is not here. Dave McKenna? Yes. Okay, the minutes pass unanimously. All right, so um, we're doing Minute Man, then Article 12, and then 30. 30, and then 30. Two and then we'll get into the finance. 31. 30, 31. 31 is the dog care. Oh, okay. 32, I oh, think, yeah, is the last. 32, I think, is the last. Yeah. And I remember one is the last. Are we going into the 12 right after that? Yes. Yes. So I'm hoping that we'll start the finance articles tonight. We'll see. Um, there's a little bit more to do about Minuteman than I was expecting. Uh, today, so let's see how long that takes. Um, so I don't think we'll finish tonight, when, and I don't think we can <laughs> no. finish on Monday. Yeah. But I mean Wednesday, but maybe on Monday. Yeah. So, um, 
The um, end of year dinner, any updates, Tara? Um, we have had eight people respond to the poll so far. Two people cannot attend the Thursday, the 15th date, but everyone who has responded so far says that they can do Wednesday the 21st. And we have two folks saying that they would be hesitant to attend an inside function if the COVID numbers were not good at that time. Um, and uh, so, yeah. So if we do Wednesday, we have two possibilities, it's raining. One is to shift it to Thursday. Another possibility is to just go inside someplace because you don't need to order uh, food for, you can wait 48 hours in advance. You could sort of see the rejection if the rejection is all like clear, clear, make a different choice than if it's iffy. That makes sense. So we could do those. I don't know, Charlie, if you're, if Thursday would work for people if we weren't able to do it Wednesday, if there was just rain that one day, but not Thursday. So you're, you're saying if we were to do something outside. We're do, yeah, so, on so one of the things is Charlie seemed happy to host again. Is, uh, I'm putting words in your mouth. He said no, he's ambivalent. <laughs> and I asked oh, you're ambivalent? Oh, I'm no, sorry. I'm I thought, I mean, That's right. Okay. Oh, no, because I can look no for, I can look for inside instead. I did. I already asked my wife for permission. So. Okay. <laughs> um, I mean, it's, 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 it, if, yeah, it's if up we, to you. If, so if, it's, it's it's your... if, if you decide to come, come to our house, we can go inside if it rains. Right. right. Okay. Yeah. And then if people aren't comfortable. I mean, I have 35 people there for Thanksgiving. So. Okay. So that could be the. We'll find room. Okay. I have some ideas already, but uh, budget numbers again. What should I be thinking of? Uh, how much? Okay, what was the ballpark in the last year? I think it was like eight hundred for the Magic Bites order, and then there was some beer, and then I got gifted a lot of rosé for my birthday that I don't drink, <laughs> yeah. so I just brought. But that didn't really get touched as much, so. Oh, I think for the budget that was eight hundred, so I think I could do that. Okay, I think we if, yeah. If we're talking about thirty, about thirty people, or we're talking about much more than that. Um, so I estimated like twenty five to thirty. So mm -hmm. if everyone in the finance committee comes, and me, and Julie Wayman, and, and John Dice, Peter Howard, and yeah. Mary Margaret Franklin, on, that's like twenty five people. Okay, and we have some others that stepped down last year. Okay. Okay. Oh yes, right, yeah. yes. Yeah, I think 800 should so be So 30 fine. then. Yeah, I, I, I think the, the top, we can go up to 1,000. Okay, that's easy to do. Easy to do. So, uh, so it sounds like people would, the safest course would be outside. Right. That's okay with Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Uh, it is more in position on you than anything it's, else. It's, uh, I mean, it's a little safer because people were wandering around. We're not like sitting in a hallway with yeah. Yeah. the same people for three hours. Yeah. Um, and I remember after dinner we had a nice little circle in the line. It was, yeah, yeah. It, was nice. it was nice. That's a beautiful yard. It's really spectacular. That's my wife's yard. Yes, it is beautiful. <laughs> we should have it this year just so all the new people can see it. <laughs> all right. So, so maybe we would have the twenty first with the rain date. The twenty second is that what yours? That's what I was thinking. That makes sense. But, but we could also go inside. That would be the other option. Yeah. Okay. Sounds like a, okay. a Sounds great. Okay. Right. Um, that's all I had. Does anyone have anything else that they want to raise, bring up right now? This is just an off the wall question, but if it seems as though the uh, proposal for uh, post corner is falling apart, <clears throat> would the town, and let's just say we would like the town to think about doing something in terms of the archdiocese property mm -hmm. would the finance committee take a position on that or how would how would something like that unfold who would start it you think? what's that who would start it yeah mm -hmm. i mean with, with this supposition that some people might say well the town can't afford to do anything like that it's just like <coughs> Me to acquire it, what's that to acquire the property well i guess so yeah mm -hmm. or control it yeah acquire it to control the development of it or something or Acquire it to build a turf field there. It was three years when we did the Sims. I know. So we got something out. I mean, there's a lot of other properties that have kind of gone away because we haven't done anything. Is it? I just don't know if the finance committee would would take a role or a position in that, or if it's just up to the manager or how that would work. 
Well, it, with the Sims property, that was actually instigated by Alan McClendon. Mm -hmm. And um, it was, we had a, a debt exclusion, mm -hmm. but we also, the, 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 the result of the property paid that, that, that never hit the tax rate. Right. For two reasons. One is um, we did it through through a uh, urban renewal um, fund or, or uh, structure. Mm -hmm. uh, I can't remember whether we created a new one or we used the one over here in Maple Street, but we had a, it was through an urban renewal. And then secondly, uh, we sequestered all the revenues from it until the bonds were paid off, mm -hmm. which we finally did about three years ago. So it actually didn't, didn't cost the taxpayers. Mm -hmm. So we bought it and ended up with a revenue producing thing or partially developed. Well, I mean, there are lots of different options, right? We might say we really want fields there because it would be a really valuable thing. So, in, But in order to do that, we have to buy the parcel. Or we might say we want to buy it because we really want to have something else happen there. Control development. Yeah, but the, the, point, the point that I'm trying to make is if, if we buy it and put fields there, that's not going to produce revenue. That's right. So that's why. Yeah, and that, that's, that would be money related. And that's, that's going to have a big impact on the capital plan. Spending does. That's why we're. That's yeah, no, I understand. I'm just yeah. saying that, that, that there's a whole, if you look in the capital plan, they have a queue a mile long for right. worthwhile mm -hmm. projects. Right. And would be uh, difficult. And that's not a finance committee. At, at first blush, that's not a finance right. committee initiative. Uh -huh. Uh, so but it would be a capital plan. Sims still, you see Sims debt on the capital plan, and your that's exempt debt then. Does not hit the or, or you're saying no? Not. It's I, I think it's paid off. It's paid off now, but for the last few years, hasn't it been on the yeah? But it gets plan? paid. We got we passed an article in the uh, town meeting mm -hmm. that says all the revenues that come from Sims get go, go to, to that pay the debt. Right. I see. Pay the debt. Got it. Got so it. it never really affected. Got it. Uh, okay. Got it. I mean, I remember seeing it off, but I didn't. I didn't yeah, really. The wash, basically. Got it. Okay. What are the revenues for the Sims Field, or what, where do they come from? Like people. Well, Sims is a is a residence. Yeah, property. Oh, I'm okay. sorry. I thought you were talking about a field. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Got Sims is like it was gotcha. there. Yeah, they got the hospital. Oh, okay. So the material state yeah. yeah. We got woods. We got. Oh, business. up on the hill. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Yes. Okay. You can see it from the high school. Yeah. Yeah. I've heard the open space committee may be looking into that, have some sort of multidisciplinary brainstorm to mm -hmm. now that it's like the doors have sort of opened. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, it's out of scope, I think, for this particular town meeting to discuss that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. But, but some ideas can maybe get some. I mean, there is a fall time meeting, but I don't know. There may be again. Some, there's going to be a fall time meeting, but I'm not sure. Uh, right. Any deal right. could come up that way. Right. Does anyone know if we have exceeded the 40B threshold at this point? Oh, no. Well, Nowhere near. Nowhere near, really? No, we're about. We seem to always under, be just under. No, we're way okay. under. We're under 7%. Okay. No, no, yeah, but no, 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 no. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah, the land. Yeah, the land. We are. Yeah, there's, there's, there's debate about the land, um, but there's only a few municipalities that have ever gotten approval for that land number. It's very hard to meet. The state is very strict about that. So it's still not clear that, our, I mean, there are people who argue that we're just under it or about yeah. or over it, but I'm not sure the state takes So it's not a done deal yet because that's, I don't think that's the state obviously takes an issue. The state's very, very um, concerned. It's very closer with Sunnyside and stuff like that. Right? Yeah. What? With Sunnyside and stuff like that, we must be 50 getting. 50 units, that's not very many. I mean, in the grand scheme. But against the land, the, the land. land. Oh, oh, the land issue. Yeah, again, again, there's only a few municipalities that have gotten approved from the state. So I think the state's very careful. So, so when they turn you down and you appeal it, you go to a housing board. Right. right. So it seems like we've been this close to it yeah. for a number of right. years. And that there's been a number of projects and at yeah. some point. Yeah, but I think it's, you have to distinguish between these people who are advocating that we're close to it and then the state's perspective. And I feel like those are just different. It's like Zeno's paradox. Yeah. It's the catch 22 where they raise a the number of missions every time the guy gets close to it. That's very similar to it. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yosarian was his name. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, I gotta go fill my water yeah. bottle. So. All right. Yeah. So, see you guys down there. Yeah. Motion to adjourn. So move. So move. Yeah. All in favor? Aye. 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 Aye.